Hey guys, welcome to WordPress Tips and Tricks. In this video, we will show you how to display your total user count on your WordPress landing page. On our side, we have a total of four users on our website, and we will display this number on our page. If we look into the appearance dashboard, we are currently using the 2023 theme. This is a default WordPress theme that doesn't allow direct theme function modifications, and we can display the total user count with manual codes or using a plugin. For this case, we will stick to a plugin. So hover over the plugin dashboard and select Add New. Now search for the Simple Blog Stats plugin and install it on your website. The plugin is already activated on our end. Now access the plugin dashboard through the settings panel. Here, click on the shortcodes tab and you will find a bunch of shortcodes in it. Find the code for user count or the number of users and copy it. Now let's go into our page, start editing it, and then you can simply paste the shortcode within a paragraph. You could use the shortcode widget, but it also works like this. And you can just bold the shortcode in order to bold the user count. Now update and view the page to confirm it. There you have it. Now, if you wanna show user count without actually relying on any additional plugin, you can do that too. First, we are going to deactivate the simple blog stats plugin. Then go into the Theme option under the Appearance tab. For manual coding, you need a theme that lets you modify the functions, BHP file. We chose the free version of Astra theme for this. You can go with any you like. Then, under the Appearance tab, click on the Theme File Editor option. There, select the functions, .php file, and scroll down to the bottom. At the end, paste this code. Find it in the comments of this video. This code has two parts. The first part pulls the user count data from your site's theme, and the second part generates a custom shortcode to display the count. For this, we named the shortcode to subscriber underscore count. Now copy the code and save the changes. We will go back to our landing page and reload it. As we deactivated the plugin, the previous shortcode won't work anymore. So, let's edit the page and replace the shortcode with the one we just created. Update the page and see that the user count is properly displaying on the page. From another perspective, it's suggested to not touch the theme file editor if you lack expert knowledge about it. Also, updating themes will erase any changes made by you. So, to be safe, you can use a code injector plugin, like WP Code for WordPress, to add these custom codes to your theme. Plus, they don't disappear on updates. Just go for the Add Snippet option under the Code Snippets dashboard, click on Use Snippet under the Add Custom Code option, and then paste the code in the field below. Then select PHP Snippet Code Type, and maybe give a name to your script. You can also change the shortcode text anytime you want. We are going with users underscore count this time. Then turn on the active switcher and save the snippet. Now, same as before, let's check our landing page. The previous shortcode no longer works. Now, from the editor, replace it with the new shortcode, and the user count is visible once again. This is how you can easily show your total user count on WordPress. That's the end of the video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and follow our channel to get more tips and tricks videos. See you soon.